Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'm gonna create a pose video so I can use it with Animate Anyone. I like this uh, Animate Anyone node. It lets you animate picture to whatever pose you want. So let's get started. I'm gonna do a load video upload, VHS load video. And there's that. That's not what I'm gonna use, but that is uh, the output we're gonna get. I'm gonna do an image batch to image list over here and join this to this. I'm just gonna swap this uh, to explain that I like it better this way. I'm gonna do a DW pose estimator here. Join this there. Everything's enabled. Uh, B box detector. I'm gonna leave it as it is, and let's change that to this. And use an image remove background. Let's use the alpha go right here. Turn this to there. And do an image list to image batch. So basically converting it back to a batch from batch. And I'm going to do save image extended here. There you go. And we're going to do a video combine here. I'm going to join the images there. So let's change this. Choose video. That's my superior. Um, I've got it in this folder. Dances. Uh, shuffle. Can you shuffle? So we're going to use this and generate a pose. Let's see if all the other settings look okay. Background. I'm going to change this to zero. Change this to one. Uh, file name. I want it to say Grayman Shuffle. Uh, resolution. So it saves the resolution. Folder. Grayman Shuffle again. And change this to resolution. When I look into this, there's a whole bunch of other stuff you can use. You need to look at the save image extended uh, node git and you'll find a whole bunch of stuff that you can use instead of uh, say resolution. Everything else looks fine. We've got images on VHS. I'm going to change this to 30 frames per second because this video is actually 30 frames per second. I'll show you that right to here. Dances, got a program called Media Info, and it's a 10 seconds, well, just under 11 seconds, the video. And if you go here, it's 30 frames per second here, and it's 720 by 1280. I'm going to change that to 30, uh, 30 frames per second. Loop count zero. I'm going to call it gray and shuffle. I'm going to change that to H264. I'm going to change that to 10 LE. True, true. Yeah, so this would convert this video into a pose video. This may take a while. You may even have to run this in batches, say the first 100, then the next 100, or 50 even depending on how much VRAM you have. You can see that here is uh, taking each frame of the video and converting it individually. So 10 seconds, let's say 11 seconds. 11 times 30, 330 frames. It's actually 323, I believe. Uh, so it's going to run, do this 323 times, one for each frame. Let this finish. Okay, so it saved all the images, or poses I should say. If you zoom in, you can see all the poses. And it also generated a video with all these images or poses. So if we go into the folder, Comfy UI, output, the Grayman Shuffle, there's all the poses. There's 323, oh, that's correct. So you can load them up into your favorite editing program and edit them if you like to change anything maybe move legs or whatever or arms to whatever pose you want or you could even create each individual pose yourself and if you look at it here uh, there's Grayman shuffle there's a video I'll show you something else here you can change say frame load cap to say 10 and you'll only do 10 frames. So 30, you'll only do 30 frames. So 
if you don't have a lot of VRAM, you can do this and run batches. So you'll do the first 30 frames. And if you change this to 30, you'll start from frame 31 and do the next 30 frames. Uh, you can do uh, image preview and preview the image and see each individual step. Just going to change this to i'm going to bypass this because i don't want the images saved but we can run this we'll do the 30 frames as you can see and it in 30 frames if you zoom in you can see which frames now it's going to convert each one individually as it did before So there's the poses from this to this and uh, on this one with the image remove background alpha it removes the background okay say you got a bunch of images you could do load image list from directory so change this instead of the video you'd have a directory say um wherever this is you got a bunch of files like this you'd load the whole directory and cap it as well to batches instead of a video if you enjoyed this video please hit the like button and we'll go carry on in the next video with the next step to create an animation of your own with the poses here as always links are in the description 